Assalamu alaikum my dear students hope you all are doing well and missing your school this is your math class and i am your math teacher here as you can see new pound on book 2 i hope you have this book or if you haven't purchased yet then buy it as soon as possible from this book we will learn some new interesting math logic This is your weekly syllabus. So, in week one, the given following learning objectives will be covered, and these are: do exercise two on page number two in Oxford New Countdown Book Two; do exercise three on page number two in Oxford New Countdown Book Two; do exercise four on page number three in Oxford New Countdown Book Two. Do exercise five on page number three in Oxford New Countdown Book Two. Write forward counting from one to hundred to hundred in your notebook. Write the number in words of the following in your notebook: ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety. Hundred. Let's learn about the concept of greater and smaller numbers. As you can see in this picture, there is a crocodile, and crocodile have special symbols which are useful for greater and smaller number. Let's understand the sign with the help of crocodile mouth. The smaller sign indicate that the closed end of crocodile towards the small number. Greater sign indicate that the open end of crocodile towards the greater mouth. Now, take out your math countdown book and open page number two. Do exercise two. Which way should hungry crocodile open his mouth? Dear students, always remember, crocodile likes to eat bigger number. Let's start it. In A, eighteen is smaller than nineteen. Now put the smaller sign. In B. Fourteen is smaller than twenty-four. Now put the smaller sign. In C, twenty-one is smaller than twenty-nine. Now put the smaller sign. In part D, seventy-six is smaller than eighty-one. Now put the smaller sign. In Part E, fifty-three is the greater than fifty-one. Now put the greater sign. In part F, forty is smaller than fifty-one. Now put the smaller sign. In part G, twelve is smaller than seventy. Now put the smaller sign. In part ten. In part H, hundred is greater than ninety-nine. Now put the greater sign. In part I, sixty-six is smaller than ninety-nine. Now put the smaller sign. Now, students, let's start numbers counting, which comes before, after, and between. So in the first picture, what come before? Yes, it is seventeen. So in the first picture, what come before? In the second picture, what come after? Yes. Do you know? Yes, it's twenty. 
In the third picture, what come after between 17 and 19? It's 18. Let's start the exercise now. As you all remember, the counting you can do this exercise very easily. Open page number 2 and do exercise 3. Write the numbers that come before, after, between. In F section, 1 is done for you. Let's do before first. Before number mean what come in previous. What come before 54? It's 53. What come before 11? It's 10. What's come before 70? It's 69. What's come before 100? It's 99. What come before 38? It's 37. What's come before 41? It's 40. Now start the after number. After number are those which come next to given number. What come after 77? Now count. 77. 78. Yes, it's 78. What's come after 29? It's 30. What come after 40? It's 41. What comes after 16? It's 17. What comes after 59? It's 60. What's come after 12? It's 13. So we have done before and after. Now we will do the number which comes in between. So student, what come in between 39 and 41? Yes, it's 40. Now what comes in between 98 and 100? Right, it's 99. What come between 55 and 57? It's 56. What's come between 48 and 50? It's 49. What comes in between 10 and 12? It's 11. What's come in between 67 and 69? It's 68. So now let's start sending order. What's the sending order? Ascending order is when number are arranged from smallest to biggest. As you can see, number are increasing step by step. Now open page number 3 and do exercise 4. Put these number in ascending order. As you can, 1 is already done in this exercise for you. Let's start from part B. Here are some numbers. Now pick the number from smallest to largest and put in the given box. So what's the smallest number here? It's 14. Then 19. 27, 78, 86, then 87. Write on in the given box. Now part C. The smallest number is 13. Then 44, 46, 51, 72, 99. And now put. Okay. In part D, what's the smallest number? Yes, it's 6, then 8, 23, 47, 54, 98. So that how we have completed the exercise by arranging all the number in ascending order. So students, now let's start sending order. Now 
do you know what is descending order descending order is when numbers are arranged from largest to smallest here as you can see numbers are decreasing step by step now open page number 3 and do exercise 5 for these number in decreasing order as you can see one is already done for you in your book now let's start from b there are some numbers you have to arrange them in decrease descending order so pick the largest number yes it's 100 then go in decreasing what will be next number it will be 99 then 77 58 49 then 2 Now put section C. The largest one is eighty-five. Then going towards the decreasing order, there will be eighty-two, forty-nine, thirty-two, seventeen, then six. Now put party. The largest number is ninety-nine. and by follow the order decreasing order there will be now 98 99 98 93 92 69 then 39 okay students now take out your math notebook and write down the forward counting from 1 to 200 to follow the given pattern as you all remember you have already done in class 1 in okay, class now do your work neat and clean yes as you can see numbers numbers are given in words you have to revise the number in words from 1 to 100 do you remember O N T E one T W O two. Now write. Write down the number in words of the followings: ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, hundred. Now write down the number in words from one. Ten to hundred. Ah, in your math book, follow the given pattern and do your work neat and clean. Okay, and run the spelling also. Okay, so my dear students, let's find up quickly. Homework. We will meet you soon, inshallah. Till then, take care. Allah Hafiz.